Good day, mate. This episode, Mookie's in Australia. Also, for Appies with Chappie by the Lake, we got Shrimp on the Barbie. I'm going to make a Blue Marlin and a Sidewinder's Fang. So we saved you a seat at the bar. Come join Mookie and myself for a nice beverage right here on Chappie's Tiki Bar. Aloha and welcome to Chappie's Tiki Bar. I'm Chappie, this is my bar. Uh, Mookie's going to be along a little later. She's on assignment in Australia for best tropical destination stories. Uh, first up, we're going to make a drink. I'm going to do a blue marlin. So I got my cocktail shaker, little ice, and we got an ounce of white rum, and an ounce of blue curacao, and four ounces of lemon lime. Give it a little shake. And that is a blue marlin. Um, I don't really have a garnish. It got me kind of thinking, like in a post-pandemic world, are we going to have garnishes when the bars open back up? Like if you think about it, you order a nice tiki drink, there's a, there's a slice of fresh pineapple, somebody's got to slice it, touch it, put it in the, uh, on the bar, and then the, the bartender picks it up, touches it, puts it in your drink. Person that gets served the drink, they touch it, put it in their mouth, put it either on the table or on a napkin and then the busboy or server comes along and touches it. Like, it's a lot of touching. Same, same with the beer nuts. I, I've seen them do this where at the end of the night they get a, like a coffee can and and uh, take the beer nuts off the bar and just put them in a coffee can and you, you know they're going to use it the next day. Like probably hundreds of people have touched those nuts over the course of several weeks. I, I did read uh, in Anthony Bourdain's first book, like uh, even bread, like in restaurants when they put it on the table, if you don't eat it or, or break it apart or touch it, they just take it to the kitchen and put it in a fresh basket and give it to the next per person. So it just got me to thinking like, are they going to not have garnishes when, <laughs> when the bars open back up? Anywho, as I said, Mookie's uh, on location in Australia for Best Tropical Destination Stories. So, uh, take it away, Mookie. Thank you, Chubby. Uh, this is Mookie on location. I'm at the home of Jenny Bonell from Toowoomba, Australia. She and her husband are the proud parents of 16 children. That's right, she is from Toowoomba. No pun intended here, Chappie. So, Miss Bonell has agreed to uh, give me an interview... Oh, oh, this just in, we have some breaking news. It appears Miss Bonnell will be unable to uh, do the interview with me, Chappie, as her uterus has fallen out. Back to you, Chappie. Appies with Chappy by the lake. All right, I'm just gonna do some uh, shrimp skewers. So I got it uh, soaking in water, the wooden uh, skewers. So I think I'm gonna leave the uh, shell on uh, just because it keep, keeps it a little uh, juicier, keeps the uh, juices inside and uh, it doesn't dry out. All right, so I'm gonna give it a, just a hit of fresh lemon. And a little bit of olive oil. And then we'll get these on the grill. I got my grilled shrimp skewers. 
So I'm going to do a sidewinder spang. Um, I need to do a garnish. I'm going to try to do a little snake uh, from the orange peel. So there's my snake. I'm going to build him a little head. And I got a toothpick. I'm going to give him some eyes. And there's my snake garnish. So here goes the Sidewinder's Fang. I'm getting this from uh, Smuggler's Cove recipe book. It says as it used to be the legendary Lanai restaurant in San Mateo, California. Beware of the serpent's bite. One and one half ounce of fresh lime juice. One and one half ounce of orange juice. Uh, one and one half ounce of passion fruit syrup. Uh, see here how I make my passion fruit syrup. If I could turn back time, I would subscribe to Chappie's Tiki Bar right away. If I could turn back time, I'd subscribe to Chappie's Tiki Bar and I'd make you stay. And if you hit that notification bell, well, I got you, babe. And I got flowers in the spring, if you make that notification bell ring. I don't need you anymore. I don't need you anymore. I got your subscription, babe. All right, in goes the passion fruit syrup. One ounce of black rum. I have some Captain Morgan's black. Nice cork. And one ounce of aged rum. This is a light aged rum. It says three ounces of seltzer. I'm just gonna put some ice in the glass. Add the mix. And then I have some club soda instead of seltzer. So three ounces of that. And there is my uh, snake garnish. another edition of Chappie's Tiki Bar. Uh, make sure you give us a like and uh, if you've already subscribed hit that notification bell and that'll remind you when uh, Mookie wants to do a new video. Um, also if you haven't subscribed hit that subscribe button it's just down there. It's that big red button. Come on now hit it. All right um, I'm Chappie and this is Mookie and we're saying life is hard. That's just the way it goes, but sometimes it goes the other way. See you next time on Chappie's Tiki Bar.